Have you ever found yourself in a situation where you finally get a chance to audition for a role, but you aren't sure how to do this late? If so, then this video is for you. I'll explain everything about this late here so that you can get the full picture. Let's begin. The slate is essentially an introduction that you deliver to the camera. It's kind of like saying hello to the casting director and decision makers, but on camera. This way they can remember you when they're going through all the submissions later. It's also a chance for actors to make a good first impression. What should I say in the slate? There is no standard formula for a slate. All you need to do is just carefully read the request from casting director and prepare the slate accordingly. They usually ask for common things like your first and last name, you can use your stage name if you have one, representation, your location, age if you're under 18 years old, union, your height, and uh, the character you're auditioning for. Let's break down the audition request I got recently. Unfortunately, I can't share all the details about this project, but I think it's fine. This video is not about it. So, as you can see, I need to tail the slate with name, height, and location. Let's film it. Hello, I'm Oksana Andrules. I'm 5 feet 9 and I'm based in Montreal. Thanks for having me. Now the big question is, should you slate as yourself? or stay in character for this slate. There are two camps. One side says, just be yourself when you slate, uh, like you saw me doing before. The other side is all about slating in character, like you living and breathing the role from the get-go. What's the best way to go? Well, it really depends. If this is your first time auditioning for a particular casting director, it's best to slate as yourself. You may have heard the saying you're auditioning for the room, not the role. They want to know what you can bring to the table if they call you in for a project. They want to get to know you. If you're auditioning for someone who knows you or your work, it's acceptable to slate in character. But again, use your best judgment and trust your instincts. If you feel like you want to slate in character, just do it. Let me show you an example. I'm Dacre, and I'm going for the role of Billy. The thing is, leaning into your character's accent and energy in your slate can make your overall audition better. Because it's not just about delivering your lines, it's about showing that you are fully committed to the role you have. You can match uh, a bit of the energy that you have in the scene to the slate. Whether you want to do your slate in character or as yourself, the only thing that really matters is you feeling comfortable doing it. Just be present and genuine. Another question is, do I stick with the character's accent or can I slate with my real one? There are no hard and fast rules here. I heard different things. Some people say that it's better to keep this illusion and slate in character's accent. Um, others say that uh, it's fine to reveal your real accent. It doesn't hurt. Some casting directors would like to see your full body shot, so to see how your body looks like on tape. Uh, in this case, you can start from the medium close up and zoom out to your full body shot or you can film your full body shot uh, separately and just edit them and put them together after. Let me show you how I would do that. Hello, I'm Oksana Andrules. I'm 5 feet 9 and I'm based in Montreal. Thanks for having me. Let's talk about technical side of the slate. Depending on um, the casting instructions, you might need to edit your slate. You might need to put it at the beginning of your audition or at the end of your audition or send it as a separate file. Uh, you can find uh, this information in the instruction that you've given. 
another thing that make sure that you use uh, the proper framing and um, you know, film horizontally. So most of the time, um, everyone is asking to film horizontally, but again, check it out when you get the request. Well, do not do these things in this late. Do not apologize. Do not say something unless requested to. Don't mumble and don't move around. And last but not least, be confident, be positive. Imagine that you are talking to the friend when you are delivering your slate. Please remember that the slate is only one part of the process and it's good to have it done properly and keep in mind everything we've talked about today. But the most important thing is your acting skills. That's it for me, thanks for watching. I hope you find this video helpful and I'll see you in the next one.